you know, because a lot of, I was exposing a whole lot of fake ass bloggers, you know what I mean? Niggas that be posting fake news that people should stop fucking with because these are the type of niggas that got the world, you know, corrupt and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? So I just look at it like, um, you know what I'm saying? We just got to stay away from these type of people though, bro. As far as niggas doing their interviews with these type of niggas and whole times, it's like, these niggas can't even afford to, they, that's why they doing all types of weird ass shit. That's how I knew for a fact he was fucking with a tranny because like, bro, you doing weird shit. You putting any type of, you put anybody on your page for literally views and clicks and likes. So I'm just like, well, yeah, I know he'll do some weird ass shit because dude ass weird as hell. You know what I'm saying? So you, you this is how dumb a lot of the people is though, bro. They will get, they'll listen to a person and believe anything somebody say without facts. You get what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, you gotta understand that niggas will say anything just to say something. You know what I'm saying? Like, and then it don't be true. So now if it don't be true, you think 16 finna say, oh man, uh, my bad, bro. I found out you wasn't a snitch, and you know, uh, my bad. No, this goofy ass nigga still gonna try to get the clicks. He still gonna try to, you know what I'm saying, get money off some bullshit ass lies. And that's the thing though, bro. You know what I mean? So you, you gotta pay attention to weird ass niggas like that. You did.